Good morning. We are so happy that you're here. We daily vlog, so if you like this video, we hope that you will come back tomorrow. It is before 7 a.m. I am headed to my 39-week checkup with Teddy. Um, I turned 39 weeks yesterday, so we are officially less than a week away from our due date. Um, not gonna lie, my nerves have started to kick in. Honestly, I feel like that's why last night, like, I just fell asleep. Um, so yeah, big appointment today. I know they're gonna offer me some things to get labor going. Um, and honestly, I'm, I'm kind of, Peter and I talked and like, we, he's okay with like me making an on the spot decision, depending on how like everything goes. So, I'll keep you updated. Alrighty, I am back home. Everything went well. Um, just with our plan, as far as like James and getting ourselves ready, I decided to deny a cervical exam or a membra membrane sweep um, because it'll just work better if we can get past this weekend. Obviously, if I go into labor on my own, fabulous. We'll be able to figure things out but just for like our plan we decided that it would just be best so I'm going to go in next Tuesday so not even a full week and we'll recheck everything then and we're also going to do an ultrasound just to make sure his position is good because I of my history with James um and just like to make sure that my, my fluid is all good and that I'm gonna have an ultrasound too. So, uneventful, um, but things can get eventful very soon. <laughs> Tuesday's only five days away. We're taking it easy today. What do you got? Breakfast burritos. This place better be good with a name like that. Dad took his breakfast burrito. <laughs> We're all a little out of sorts today. I woke up on the wrong side of the bed. What is this? Sauces. Wow. Ooh. We gotta cut him open so you can see inside. Peter's is called the Chachi. It's got eggs and pastrami and sausage and potatoes and cheese and onions. Mmm. Mine looks the same, but it's scrambled eggs, potatoes, impossible sausage, onions, and cheese. And I got a like spicy pesto sauce to go on it. What's the verdict? It's the greatest burrito I've ever eaten in my whole life. <laughs> it is pretty good. James e agrees. Life is just very tough when you're a puppy named Eve. James e is taking a little snooze, so I feel like I can elaborate on us waking up on the wrong side of bed. One, well, we're just at the point in pregnancy where sleeping isn't great. And so I feel like we just like, that affects your day. And then two is that I have been feeling the anxiety of the fact that now labor and delivery has to happen. You know, came to terms with our decision 
have really worked through all of the trauma, like our experience with James. But now I gotta do it. And um, I think that it's just like very real, the fact that, you know, things can get started any day. Also that they would like offer to do certain procedures that would jumpstart things. So just the fact that like we're doing this again um, is taking a toll on me. And I just, I want to be strong and confident and it's just, you know, it's extremely difficult. There's no, um, like as much as I've worked through the trauma, it does not go away. Like it does not, um, the fact that it happened does not just leave my, my memory. So we're working through that stuff and we are so, so, so excited to meet Teddy for for James to be big brother for like our life, like we're ready for this, you know, this big life moment. Um, but that's exactly what it is, big life moment. Um, but I just finished up the vlog and Peter's taking out Eve. And then soon we'll actually have to get organized because James is going to do his trial swim lesson today. So we are, definitely looking forward to that but it just like feels like one of those days where once you're done with your to-do list and your workload that you just want to like shut down but I think this one lesson will will brighten our spirits for sure also I think it goes without saying even though I've said it a gazillion times um that we're so so grateful for this pregnancy that we know truly how um how incredibly blessed we are with our infertility journey and all of that. Um, some days are just heavier than others and today is one of those days. Well, we woke up James to leave to go to his swim class and he woke up, but now he's back asleep. And we are, we just never wake him up. Like we always let him wake up on his own. So this is, this is going to be interesting. He's awake, he's awake, he's awake. Okay, James, let's go in the pool. You ready? We're gonna go swimming. good to have a different interesting view of downtown we were at blue the chicago blue dolphins swimming class james did you have a good time he did we're snacking on tomatoes and raspberries Ooh. oh i hear my ed sheeran song in the car driving by i gotta get in and start the ac we're just hanging out playing in the living room while mom cooks dinner before we go on a little walk later yeah dude you had you did so good at swim class all right, here is dinner. Sarah just informed me. She didn't show any of it. And I said, "Are you, do you even vlog? We got curry, vegetables. What is this? So this is a white bean salad. So white beans, tomato, avocado, lemon juice, salt, pepper, dill. And, and on the pita? inside there's pesto mayo. Ooh. And then this is the, um, the same garlic and cherry sauce that we had before from Trader Joe's and white rice. Manjo. Thank you for cooking it. Can we get slippies after? Yeah, not a breath. Oh gosh. Look at this gorgeous wraparound ivy blooming. We're getting my one mile walk in. The stop for slurpees. And there's just too many cars here for me to like do the curb walk. Remember I did that in Magic Kingdom? She just goes, oh, I should be curb stomping. This is not a curb stop. No, this is not a... What? Not oh. a Donald? What happened to you? <laughs> work it, work it, work it out. <laughs> 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 it's so goofy. 
Oh yeah. You know what you gotta say to this? Freaking bats. Love Halloween. Love Halloween. Look at this. What the heck is this? This is like a real spooky song. I'm by myself. I haven't felt like this empty since then our DCP 2011 after the um Halloween party preview for cast members. I'm really, like we're having a conversation and we're across the street from each other. Hello over there. Tired? <laughs> well you look great. Thanks. Imagine if we were having the C-section tomorrow. <laughs> I think we should just go to Magic Kingdom. Can I have racy sticks? And some Slurpee. They have pineapple whip, I'm really intrigued about. Cheers. <laughs> a piece of Reese's in my toe. <laughs> Cheers. Our 14 year best friend anniversary is tomorrow. is tomorrow. But that's what we would do when we were young, didn't have licenses or cars. We meet at 7 Eleven, get Slurpees. They used to have Sour Punch straws. So good. Oh, this yeah. Is is it? Nope. This is a great deal. Four dollars. You have to buy three, but like, so I drink. I drink one every day. <laughs> what do you make? What are you making a ruckus over there for? <laughs> You're so helpful. All right. I don't even know what we ended up vlogging last. Been a bit. Um. Put James down. Did some dishes. We're kind of pooped. I've kind of been ride, rocking like a headache today and Sarah got up super early to go to um, Teddy's checkup. Um, so it was like, we have plans, but it's still like, we think that next week will be the exciting week and we're just kind of buying time. But yeah, we're just gonna hang out. Our room, Sarah turned on the AC unit like an hour ago in our bedroom, so it's like nice and and cool in here so hopefully it'll be good sleep because I don't think either of us got good sleep last night. Jamesy went to bed really easily so hopefully that means he will be out. I'm excited it's Friday. We have like not really big plans but we have ideas for plans this weekend because we're on like baby notice. Um, so I'm excited to show you this weekend. May 12th, Thursday, Catherine the Great. A great wind is blowing and that gives you either imagination or a headache. Hey, I want the imagination, not the headache. But I got the headache today. Tomorrow, it'll be the imagination. <laughs> it's good to be home. <laughs> Peace, oh, who are you? We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions.